Good morning. I'm gonna come out and check on the hoop house, see if I have any lettuce left in there. Uh, we've had a lot of uh, low, low temps in the teens lately, um, last week or so. And we had a foot of snow up until uh, this morning, last night. And it is now 52 degrees out, um, which is pretty crazy. If you watch the last one you, episode, you'll know that we had to remove the um, power cord that was running into our greenhouse for our electric heater. So that's all gone. So this is now, oh, there's bugs in here. <laughs> it's now about 65 in, uh, not even, maybe 55 in here. So it's not that much warmer in here than out there. I'm just checking on a few things. Got some broccoli still there, some parsley. Everything needs some water in here. It does uh, get pretty dry. I had put this um, block of ice in here. Looks like there's still some ice. Um, left on this. So trying to uh, put the ice to melt around the plants to give some water. But the broccoli looks all right. A lot of the lettuce actually looks pretty fine still. Um, Snapdragon's got completely eaten by something in here. And then I did cover over this side with some frost cloth, so first time checking on it. We'll see how everything's doing. We still have flowers. That's crazy. Look at the broccoli. Lettuce. Looks good. And some lettuce. So we're going to pick some lettuce. It's not going to grow very much very quickly right now. But look at the stock. These were planted in the spring and they're still still going and we're what two days before Christmas? Here in uh, north central Massachusetts you can see the snowbank behind here. Uh, zone 5B. Um, it's going to drop down to 7 degrees tonight from the mid 50s, mid to high 50s down, down that low, which is absolutely crazy. Um, so I'm going to pick a bunch of stuff now. Um, keep, you know, keep the plants going. They'll still be fine in here, um, in theory. And um, as we've now passed uh, solstice, the days will start getting longer, which is great. Oh, man, it's just so pretty. I'm so happy about that. Um, and these little onions should be really good for uh, for spring onions. But see if I can get enough enough lettuce for some salad, toss salad. I'll put some of the broccoli leaves in there. Uh, too bad about the snapdragons. I was excited to potentially have some. It's late season snaps, but these really got eaten. Um, kind of looks like I came in here with cl with clippers, actually. Um, and Salary's kind of on its way out. Um, transplanted it in here a little late, and then I didn't have a water source to do. So I'm going to bring some snow in here um, and put some snow around some of these plants to melt. Um, the solar, the sun isn't going to be too good today because it's supposed to continue to rain. Uh, winds are gusting somewhere around uh, high 50s and 60s. Um, and then the other thing is, unfortunately, I'm not sure if you'll see this or not, but during some plow cleanup, we did get a hole in the side there. So I was really worried about the lettuce with the temperatures. <laughs> I'm not sure you can hear the rain. But it, um, I should probably finish up quickly in here and get back inside before it's 
really starts coming down again. All right, so I've moved some snow in here. This will hopefully melt during the day today and will give us just a little bit of, of water for these plants. Just kind of sprinkled it out. They don't need much water right now because they're kind of slightly dormant, um, but anything will help. Um, and so now I'm gonna go and pick a bunch of things um, some celery and broccoli leaves and some lettuce and some parsley and see what I can do to uh, add to our uh, family dinner. All right, so I've got a pretty decent amount of stuff. I've got some green onions, parsley, a bunch of lettuce and some of the broccoli. Um, I did grab one of the broccoli heads. They're pretty small. Um, you can see them in here. Uh, so, not taking too much yet, because they're still growing. They're actually bigger than they were, which is great. I didn't take any of the salary root, these guys. I'm gonna try to get them to keep growing with some more of the snow in here. Um, but yeah, you can see I trimmed up that parsley right there. Um, that one broccoli that's kind of decapitated that one um, has the uh, had a bunch of aphids so I just cut that off and moved it out and there are some shoots on the side so we'll see if that comes back or not um, but I think that's a pretty good pretty good size so I'm pretty happy with that for my Christmas salad which was my goal this year was to be able to pick a fresh salad this late in the season in our hoop house and even with the colder temps and no heater in here, the lettuce is still doing all right. Again, it's not growing really that fast, but here in the next couple weeks, um, as the days get longer and we get start getting more some sun in here, um, these should be really good. So depending on the amount of snowfall, we'll try to keep this cleared off. Um, we should be good, but yeah, running, uh, I kept opening the door. So about 52, it says up at six feet tall, high. It's about 52 outside. So. Um, not sure how much this is really helping during the day because it's pretty cloudy. Um, but it does seem like, you know, there's a big difference between this and what I could be growing out in our birdies raised bed garden right now. So. Well, thank you guys for watching and I hope you all have a Merry Christmas. And, uh... Hopefully, oh look, I missed a carrot, a couple carrots. Maybe I'll give those to the bunnies. Um, hopefully you guys aren't getting hit with the storm too badly. I know a lot of power's out and a lot of trees have, have come down. Um, we have lost a few branches, but nothing too major at this point. So please stay safe and happy holidays. And uh, yeah, I am really excited about this salad. Oh. Uh, not sure if you heard that, but a tree just fell in our woods. So I'm going to get back inside here in a second and um, hopefully uh, we won't have too much, too much crazy cleanup to do. Um, somewhere down in there. <laughs> in our woods. Uh, definitely heard that crack, but uh, yeah, I'm going to get back inside. Thank you all for watching and um, I will keep you guys posted on how our salad goes.